bachelor of science degree in sport management. I will typically pursue careers in both the profit, for-profit and non-profit organizations. They might be uh, getting into sport administration, recreation departments, uh, front and back office in a uh, professional sport league or semi-professional sport league. Uh, they can also get into sport mer merchandising, leisure, and uh, recreation management. Students who get a, master, a Bachelor of Science in Exercise Science are typically looking to go on to graduate school for either physical therapy, occupational therapy, or chiropractic. If a student chooses to uh, solely uh, stick with their bachelor's degree, most likely they will work in a fitness facility or a gym, and they can also get certifications for personal training or group training programs. Students from any major can uh, choose to get a minor in athletic coaching, and what that does is it allows a student with the completion of those particular credits to apply to the state of New York to get certification to become a coach in either the middle school or high school. Every coach in the state of New York must be certified, and this is just one avenue uh, that a student can tie uh, those courses in with other courses uh, such as first aid uh, and prevention and care of injuries as well as an internship. Students considering transferring into our program, if they're looking at sport management, they'd want to consider uh, the following prerequisites. Introduction to psychology, introduction to sociology, a computer science course, a philosophy course, uh, statistics, and your basic English uh, written communication. If you're planning on transferring into exercise science, you might want to look at basic biologies, chemistries, calculus, physics, and anatomy and physiology. TJ Manisterski. I am a faculty member in the Sport Management and Exercise Science Department. I'm also the assistant hockey coach. Now TJ, why have you chose to coach here at SUNY Fredonia? Well, I was very excited to get the opportunity. I think it's a, it's a program uh, rich with history and tradition. It's been successful uh, and it was a great next step in my career. Why should athletes come here to SUNY Fredonia? Well, I think it's, uh, it's a great atmosphere uh, for athletes. I think you have coaches who are extremely dedicated and care about the student-athlete experience. Uh, we care about uh, not just our, how our athletes do on the field or court or ice, but uh, you know, how are they doing academically. You know, that's a big part for us. Uh, and also, you know, how are they doing uh, in the community? You know, I think we want to make sure that we are, we're always uh, doing what we can to uh, enhance our community. How do you feel SUNY Fredonia Sports Management Department and Exercise Science Department varies from other SUNY schools? Uh, well, I think the, the first thing is uh, just how accessible and caring the faculty are. I mean, I think if you go around and talk to you know, the people who, who teach your classes, they're incredibly accessible, always willing to help uh, in any way they can. Uh, I think the other thing is just great internship opportunities. Uh, we have students who go out into uh, the real world, whether that be the Buffalo Sabres or the Bandits, uh, whatever it might be. Uh, but then also there are some great opportunities for internship experiences right here on campus where you can give back to the Fredonia community as well. How has your SUNY Fredonia experience been thus far? It's been amazing, and I think it all comes down to the people. I think the, the students, through the staff and faculty and coaches, it all comes down to uh, they make the experience. 